Okay, now go to the lower left hand corner to the can windows. Close this thing? Yes, you can close that. So go, there you go, go to the lower left hand corner. Uh -huh. Yep, press on the windows icon button there. Okay. Now, in the right column, there is a devices and printers. In the right column, it says devices and printers. So, I'm going to go disappear. Okay, so you want to remove your cursor from that. Yep, there you go. Now, in your right devices hand, and printers. Hold on. Yep. Don't don't click it yet. Just push your um, your mouse cursor and hold it over the the um, the line that says devices and printers. Three third from the bottom. Got it. Right there. Okay. So we'll click on that button. Okay, you want to print a job, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. So first, go over and click on, do you see how, uh, bring your mouse cursor and hold it over the left hand, uh, bottom row, left leftmost icon that says brother, and okay, you see how that is, offline. Uh, it's opaque while the other ones are dark? Uh -huh. That means it's, uh, it's offline. Okay. Alright, so left click on that. What do you mean left click? There are two buttons on your on your mouse. There's only one. Okay. So um, on the left hand side, this would be your left button. The on the right hand side, that would be your right button. I don't see any buttons. Okay. It's they're hidden underneath the thing. Oh. Uh, the cover there. All right. So. Okay, yes, so go click on that, left click on that, just once. Okay, now go up to the top where it says uh, remove device. That's on the this column right here. Yes, click that. Are you sure? And push yes, we're sure. All right, so at this point you can either print it through uh, solid state or Jack Mehoff or what I want to walk you through is how to add a printer. So go over to the top menu bar up here and you see the icon that says add a printer. Add a printer, yeah. Yes. Okay, so left click on that. Alright, so this uh, window pops up. You want to go to add a network wireless or Bluetooth printer, which is the, the second option there. Uh -huh. And left click on that. All right, and it's going to search. Okay, so now, since that's the printer that you want, since it's highlighted, what you want to do now is you want to go down to the bottom where it says Next. The button's already highlighted, and left-click on that. Uh, what you want to do is says use currently installed driver. Mm -hmm. So yes, click on next. That uh, it's already highlighted. And this one is going to name it Brother MFC. So that's fine. So just go down to next right here. Okay, click next again. And uh, you can make this the default printer. So you want to check mark, check mark that box right now. It's asking if you want to be the default printer. Check that box. Okay, I'm going to change okay. it when I get rid of this thing and get a one that works. I'm okay. going to change this one back to the default. All okay. right. So go down to finish. Very good. So now you have. It's going to send jobs directly to this one. This one right here. So now you can actually close this window. There you go. Now, what would you like to print? Page. Okay. So go up to, you know how to do it from here, right? Yeah. So press print. Now, here's oh, here's something you need to do is you need to yeah you need to look at this drop down right here to choose your your printer. Now it's already selected, but if uh, if it wasn't selected, you would want to go to Brother MFC 8840D USB. Right. It's the third one from the top. Right. 
Alright, so goats, choose that one, pick that one. There you go. Alright, now push OK. Alright, that should go.